Hey guys, General Tabby here. Welcome to a not a, a not Halloween stream because this isn't being streamed; it's being recorded. Um, but I'm using the setup which I'm going to be using on my Halloween stream. So, yeah. But yeah, this will just be uploaded. And I just want to share with you Killing Floor 2 because I'm loving the game. I'm quite new to it, and I think it fits perfectly in with the whole Halloween theme so that is exactly what we're going to do we are just going to i'm i should i should put it on normal mode but do you know no i'm gonna do it but yeah it is it is a really fun game to play the shooting feels awesome and i just figured i would show you guys it and share it with you i hope everyone is doing well and i hope I, I win. Let's see how fast you can die, worms. <laughs> but yeah, I mean, this game is basically killing the undead to loud rock music, which is what we want. Ooh. And it's very fun. It's very fun. Like I said, the shooting actually feels like you're shooting. And when you shoot them, your bullets actually go into them and like make a mess and everything. Oh. All right. All right. So this is my trusty Winchester. Oh. But yeah, you can customize your weapons in terms of skins and stuff like that. I hope the volume's all right because I've been messing with it for about an hour. Oh. Expecting that. Oh, let me pass. Come on. This. Right, okay. Let's punch him in the face instead. It's. I admit, there are a few things about this game which make it quite difficult and annoying. And that is the fact that if you are trapped, you're trapped. It's going to be very hard to get out of that situation. And your running isn't very good. You can't sprint very fast unless you've unlocked, like, Multiple perks, which can take a while. Use your dust to buy a few more seconds of life. So yeah. Fun times. Um I am going to Oh actually I might go for a machine gun. Even I'm a sharpshooter. I've still got my sharp shooting good anyway, so we're all right. There we go. So this is my custom gun. Like this is a, a skin I, I unlocked, so it's got like gold and stuff on it. So it looks it looks nice and pretty. Um, but yeah, I, I like it. And I did get a skin for my pistol as well. And you could you could mess around with. Got a torch. What more do you want? And just wait for the next round to start in 16 seconds. I think I've actually, actually no, I better not adjust the, the, the volume on this. Oh, can I? If I turn it all the way down here, does it affect? No, it doesn't. Turn it down a bit on my headphones. There we go. I'm deafening myself and I couldn't actually hear myself talking. So I was like, if I want to be shouting the camera like, I'm killing things! No, it's not really what we wanted. But I don't know who. Who's going to come get us now? Oh. But yeah, even this pistol, the, the starting gun, um, is. Yeah. Just got a nice feeling as the shooting this game. And you get to fight all sorts of enemies. Um, this is the Halloween level, so this is where the Halloween challenges are done. And I've got a few to do, that's why I'm doing it in solo mode, because I want to get all the kills. So I can actually unlock the challenge. His head, he's got no head. This, he had no head left to him, and he was still coming at me. Ninjas now, ninja mummies. Get, get gone. They do like to grab you a lot as well. These guys. But, yeah, you can actually mess the book quite a bit with the, with the normal pistol. This rifle's quite good though. You can upgrade as well through matches, you can upgrade. Uh, but yeah, it's just a really good fun to play game. Play by yourself as well if you want. It's just 
way of survival mode, but a really good version. And it's not too easy either. Like, it does get harder. Oh, nice. Just level up. Oh, see what I mean? This, this is what happens. You just get battered, basically. You go on hard mode as well. It's not as forgiving. Oh, no, come on. Just felt like punching that one in the face. Right, how many are left? We're one left. So that's not bad. Let us return to the blood and violence. But yeah, you get like cool commentators, you get really good soundtracks. It is definitely like the most fun I've had in, in a while in one of these kind of games. Um, I actually, so I'm quite a big fan of um, Call of Duty zombies. I prefer this. I prefer this. Um, I know there's, I don't know, in some ways it's not quite as customizable, but at the same time, it just feels more fun. It feels, in some ways, like better for for, for shooting and all that kind of stuff. So, hope I don't attract too much hate for that comment, but you know. Um, right. Last chance for guns and ammo, piggies. Why have we got a high tech pistol? I didn't. I didn't buy that, did I? Did I accidentally buy a gun? Or did I? Oh, I think you can find weapons My in the game. Will be there soon. Do try to hold so I've got an extra gun. Um, where's my high tech pistol? Because it's not actually a bad gun. Oh, I hate these guys. These guys are very difficult. Why didn't I. Why wasn't I healed at the pod? I'm sure it heals you. Because these guys are really difficult in terms of. You can't outrun them. Oh, my, my guy can't currently because I've not got that thing. Right. Uh, there should be a lever down here. It's like a trap. And. Oh, it's there, and I'm too late, I'm, I'm past it. And I'm just getting flung around like a rag doll now. I don't actually know what happened then. Did, did I activate a trap by accident? Because these guys are difficult. Like, bullets just don't seem to bother them. I'm trying to sprint away from them. And they're just like, don't even matter. So it's getting quite tense now. Set my fire a bit. Get some ammo. Get some dosh. Right, he's down. I don't know who the boss is going to be. It seems to randomly pick. Um, apart from on this map, you do tend to get the the guy for this map, who's like the Halloween exclusive guy. But if you're playing more than so if you're playing like 10 rounds instead of 4, you do get to fight other, other bosses. So. And this is where you get stuck again. Of um, magazine size with this gun. Oh, uh, Banshees are. Yep. Yeah, <laughs> Scream at you and stuff. There we go. Right, where's my pod? Is this one? But yeah. I, I recommend getting the game. It's actually quite cheap. Um, it's on sale at the moment, so yeah. If you fancy popping on Steam and having a look. And then here we go. In my armor. Um, can I get. Ooh, I can dual wield these, which is still good. And then upgrade them. So the reason I'm upgrading them is because. Um, they're not that expensive to upgrade for a start. There you go. 
fair bit of ammo with them. And I actually quite like them, to be honest. Just checking everything is. Only ten more seconds of shopping, no time for bargain hunting. Although I don't actually have that much ammo for them. <laughs> Did I? I'm sure I had full ammo. Right, so this is the final wave, but after this there's a boss. So there's five waves, technically. Love my guns. But I have to kill as many things as possible as quick as I can because the uh, I don't know what the shut off date for the like challenges are. So I'm trying to kill like a thousand more. It, it, it feels great going to that mode. There's no there's no crosshairs. So you you have to just kind of you know go with your, your gut when you're shooting. But I don't know. It makes it look and feel better in my opinion. Especially when you're landing hits and you're just like, oh, you know, like, skill. Skill. Oh, I'm gonna get trapped here. Aren't I? So, yeah, I was gonna include this on the stream, um, but. I've been sorting out that many technical problems recently. I've been running out of kind of time, um, so I'm done. I'm going to be doing a few recordings to upload, and then the stream will be more just like a scary game to, to run through. With. So, yeah. And now I'm in trouble. Oh, oh no, no, no! Let me to it. Let it's right there. Right there, that's what I'm trying to press. It's very unforgiving, like once they catch up to you, those things just batter you, and you, you can't really do a lot. Like at this point now, there is no way to get past them because punching them does nothing. So that's it, you, you're dead. They just block your path and you can't do anything. And it's, it is very frustrating in this game. I know it's realistic, in terms of if a big scary fish monster blocked your path, you wouldn't be able to just push it out of the way. But it is quite annoying when they take up quite a lot of room on a narrow little you know, passage and you die. So I should have probably just done a normal just to kind of show you the end boss. Um, I did already have a video of the end boss for this, so I'll probably just put them both up separately. But you get an idea of the game and its frustrations, but it, it's still a good game, I, I, can't, I can't deny that. It's just, you have to be careful at them points. Let me exit. It probably puts me in a, to another game. I'll give you a real quick look at um, the inventory side and your, your gear. Um, and I can, oh no, it's this one, I can now add. Um, there we go, so I've, I've gone for capacity. Don't think I'm going to have enough for a crate, no. But yeah, so gear, you can pick different characters, and then you can pick emotes, headgear, kind of a lot of different stuff. Some of these are the Halloween gear. Um, there is a community market, and you can sell certain items in the community market, which is quite good. And you can also buy skins. You know, from other people. Um, this is my current collection. So even these, you can sell these online. People in the community market, your tickets and stuff like that. Crates, you will get the crate, but you can't open them. You have to buy a key, um, just like in Counter um, Counter Strike. Yeah. So that is. Uh, but you do get some pretty cool items. So that one's like one of the ones I use. Um, that's quite good. This is the one I currently use for my gun. But yeah, uh, it's a good game. Like I said, you've just got to be really careful getting blocked. That's the part that lets you down. You just get, and they're quite relentless with attacks. It's not like they hit once and just leave you for a bit. You'll get mauled. Kind of like in Call of Duty, zombies once you're trapped. That's it. Um, so yeah, level up. The more perks you unlock, it gets easier. I'm out playing as a commando level 5 um, by myself on hard mode, which isn't the highest difficulty. There is plenty more. But anyway, that's it for now, guys. Um, 
I'm just really going to show you. So if you go to seasonal, this is the current one, the Halloween TV. I'm trying to unlock this gun, and I've still got a lot of Zeds to kill. A lot. So, yeah, I might join a, a server later on Endless. Let's see how much I can do. But anyway, guys, that's it for now. Um, as always, see you in the next video, and take care.